take the section of this lens part. I am just rotating this size. Just take snipper tool. I am just try to explain you. Here I will create core and cavity and I will define the parting line. Control Z with the red pen. So in red color, this is my core side and in blue color this is my cavity I am just draw the roughly sketch to explain you where parting line will be made cavity will move in this direction and my core will move in this direction suppose initially my cavity will be in this position and my core will be in this position so this is the mold open position when mold will close then this core will move in this direction and mold will be closed by this surface it means cavity and core will match on this surface this is the common parting surface in mold close position both core and cavity will match on this common surface this will be our parting surface in parting surface there is a small opening like 50 micron or 0.1 this is the parting line so in cavity during the mold running condition the cavity will be fill the plastic material through sprue and after solidification of material core will move in this direction and core and cavity will open and part will be eject out through the ejector pins ejector pin always available in core side so suppose this is our ejector pins this is the ejector pins so after mold is open part are ejected by the ejector pins so this is our parting line we are specifically discussing about the parting line so someone asked you in interview what is parting line so your answer could be where core and cavity surface are matches that surface is called parting surface so now i am giving the second example which i am taking this specific region only okay. here in my case I have defined the parting line at this top side this one my core and cavity matching is happening at this portion so I have chosen this as a parting line this is my cavity and this is my core if i make parting line is here then 
I have to make surface like this. Otherwise, this will become a undercut. I will explain in later sessions what type of undercuts. So, in our case, it becomes undercut if we will choose a parting line at this surface, at this point. If I draw cavity here, and my cavity will be like this and my tooling direction will be like this not like that in angular direction my mold will be open in linear direction so in that case my part will be hearted by this edge because now this become a undercut so in this direction our part will get be hearted by this edge Practically you can think, suppose I am just hatching this cavity side. It will be more clear for you to understand how it becomes the undercut if we select the parting line at top side. Now this is my cavity side. This hatching represent my cavity and this linear direction is my tooling direction in this direction my cavity will be moved so during opening of mold suppose our cavity move in this direction so this particular area will be hearted or damaged by this zone so it becomes a undercut so what we can take next action so in that case we will choose this as, as a parting line. In this scenario, it will not hurted by anywhere or it will be ejected smoothly. So, we will choose this surface as a parting line, not this surface. I am just going to my model. This dotted line appear on this part is my parting line. 